What's up, guys? It's your boy, Tommy Mars. Are you ready for some more Maury? Are you ready? But we better get ready because it is time for Maury. Maury said, I want to know what love is. This is the one you guys blew up the comments, blew up my DMs, Twitter, all that stuff. And you were like, Tommy, you've got to listen to I want to know what love is. And the thing is, by the title, I think it's one of my favorite songs, okay, by Foreigner. That's what I think it is. But when she gets into it, I feel like it could be something else. So going into it, I think it's the 80s song. I don't know it for sure. I didn't listen to any of it. But we're going to watch it and listen to it together right now for the first time. And I got to tell you something. It really doesn't matter where it's from, who it's from, what era it's from. All I know is that Maury's singing it and I'm interested. I'm telling you right now, man, I have so many people in my life that send me texts, that call me, that send me DMs on my own Instagram saying, Tommy, I am hooked on Morissette. You got me hooked on her. I never heard of her. And I'm like, I didn't hear of her either till like a month and a half ago. And now I'm like, I cannot get enough. She's one of my absolute favorite singers in the world right now. I just love it so much. I just love her voice. I love everything she does. So I'm fired up either way. On a side note, if you want to reach me on the social accounts and you don't know what it is, it's T-O-M-M-Y-M-A-R-Z-B-A-N-D, Tommy Mars Band. Come hit me up. Let me know something good. All right, let's roll. Oh, I I think this is my song. Yes! Okay, this is the song I was thinking of. I'm, I'm really excited to see what she does here. I gotta take a little time A little time to think things over she looks so focused. Better read between the lines in case I need a when I'm older. In my life, mm. there's been harder complaints. I don't know if I can fight. things that she does. Oh my gosh. That gave me chills. Even at low register, she rules it all. She owns it all. She's so special. Right into that no change.
goodness. Yeah, I got a couple things. One is that to me, from what I've heard, everything I've heard from Maury, everything I heard from anybody that's ever sang, that is the most in control, in key, in pitch, whistle voice, whatever you want to call it, that I've ever heard in my life. You, you go up there and then you make some movements. She made some movements in the last one I heard. You make some little movements here and there and you do throw some vibrato in. That was among the most incredible things I have ever heard in my life. She went up there. It's not even just the movement. That was so controlled and it was so long. She stayed up there so long and she just, oh my gosh. Okay, so that's the first thing. The second thing is there are some songs back in the day. And we, we on this channel, we've talked about Mariah Carey and stuff like that. And when you get up there in the recording studio, that is a controlled environment. Control everything down to the, the thermostat. And when you get there, you prepare. So it's not like you're singing the song. You're not singing the verses. You're not singing the chorus. And then you said, hey, let's do, let's call it the whistle voice for, to make it easier here. You're going to go up and do this whistle voice, but let's sing the verses and then go up to it. That's not what happens. You, you cut everything and then you come in whatever day you're going to cut that track and then you focus on that. So everything is playing in your headphones and then you focus and go for that whistle voice and then you lay that down. It's beautiful. Everything that you hear. You know what I'm getting at here? She's in a performance. She starts a song. She's in a super, super low register right in her chest. And then, you know, she works her way up. She's going up. And that's the most impressive thing right there. She's singing in these other lower voices, mid voices, mid range. She goes almost peeks into her head voice and she's singing all these things. So her, her vocal cords are being strained. They're being used. And then she goes up into that voice. It wasn't like she just walked in the studio, got warmed up because you got to warm up and then lays down a perfect whistle voice. She just did it in the middle of a song in a live performance. So if you think I'm kind of like being overly crazy about it, I am being overly crazy because that is ridiculous. That's ridiculous. It's one thing to go up there and you show a little bit and you do it and she does it great. You know what? Let, hold on a second. Let, let me see if I can find this part again. That was, that was incredible. You may not see the video on this, but let, can, 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 let's hear this again. <laughs> Screeches. is a lot of times when singers do something that special it's like a it's almost a novelty it's like the when we were watching the oh holy night she did it in the crowd pop everybody went wild and she and she does it brilliantly but right there that just be it becomes a part of the song it, it's almost it's so good it's so perfect that it it sounds like an instrument that's what i'm getting at i know her voice is her instrument but what i mean is like it's almost like a stringed instrument or a piano that is completely 100 percent in tune and does those things in that shelf that, that's where I just got. That's where my mind went. That's what it felt like to me. I think that's why I'm having such a crazy meltdown about it or I'm so impressed. That is amazing. Thank you, Maury. And thank you, guys. Actually, that brings me to a good point. Thank you for keep recommending me where to go with more set. I actually really appreciate it because this is a great journey and I love having all of you along for the ride, along with me as we explore more set. Even people that's heard her, that knows who she is, I don't. But I also have people that follow this channel that follow me on Twitter that has never heard her. And now they're becoming fans of her. This is this is a great time and this is great. So that's the question of the video. What is the next song I got to go to from Maury? I need more. I need more. Let me know. All right. This is Tommy Mars. I will see you in the next video. Have a great start to your week. I will see you soon.